in the past six to seven years has just been an area that's been a little forgotten. Sometimes inspiration. This is the beginning of this changing into something magical. It's, it's going to be epic. Comes from unlikely places. This water tank is actually a functioning water tank. The water tank in downtown Jeffersonville is morphing into the focal point of the city's new arts and cultural district. It's the starting point is where it's at. There's a lot of things that are unknown. It's an honor. Um, I don't know, I, I feel blessed that they chose me. Louisville artist Will Sig is the man bringing the vision to life. You know, the fun part is making stuff pop and, you know, making it shiny or making it look, have a little bit more depth. His design stands out. Whimsical, it's fun. I think uh, it's obviously bright. And that's precisely what Jeffersonville Public Art Administrator Don Spiker was counting on. And I knew that we needed someone who not only could have some sort of oh, just a wild vision of what this could be, but more could handle painting such a structure, something large um, and massive. Sig freehanded the entire project. The dome was a challenge. You can't look at it. The dome is, is curved, so you can't see what's on the other side. You don't know where things line up. The wind on top of that thing is, you know, it's like a wind tunnel around it even, but on top of it, it was even worse. worked day and night through rain and brutal sun and heat to help take the Jeffersonville art scene to the next level. You can see it from the interstate and the walk bridge and I think it's going to draw people in. Every single thing we're doing, every element that we're adding to the district um, has appeal from ground level as a pedestrian but then also from an aerial view up in the sky. The water tower is just the beginning of what art lovers hope will become a go-to destination. And we really feel like this is our something else. This is something so special. Um, this is something that you can't help but notice. I think that this, this mural and then eventually this art district will rival, will rival anything in Louisville, if not the country. Carolyn Callahan, WLKY News. The 35 acres of the Arts and Cultural District in Jeffersonville will be dedicated tomorrow. It's at 7th and Spring Street from 11 to 1. The family-friendly event will feature food, music, art, and family fun. Mm -hmm.